April 9th, and it is Brickfest time. So I'm going to be doing a little bit of a um, vlog, kind of walk you guys through uh, what we see for right now. Sounds like the dogs are eating, so everything's good. And uh, I'm going to get ready to go here in a moment. Where did you go? What are you doing, Kitter? What are you doing? We gotta leave. <laughs> you gotta get ready to go. You've already been fed. What's going on? <laughs> Bagel time. Bagel. 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 Bagel together. Bagels. Bagel time. Go. Let's get the bagels. Hey, we gotta get them. How are you? Good. You're doing bagel stuff. Oh my goodness, they got so many everything bagels. What do you want? Um. Hell yeah! And so you got over here, this is the 327 Clone Troopers. Awesome. Led by Jedi Ayla Secura. Oh, Planet I love that's one of my favorite scenes. Oh yeah, right before Order 66. Yeah. That tropical planet. Over Ooh. here, this is a simple but effective one with Mace Windu and Django. We're on the Genosis Arena. Right before the end of Django. Right before the end of Django, of course. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. This is Darth Maul fighting Kree Fizzla the duel on Mandalore, and he's flying it for the Mandalorian throne. Yeah, it looks got, great. Thank you. This is what I did to achieve this build was, so I used the Lego set, which is a chair in the glass sure. there, but I used everything else is custom, so it's, I used a bunch of reference images to get these yeah. designs, and I try to make it as accurate as possible. Yeah. And then this is the Bad Bad Squad, and you have a Hunter, Wrecker, Crosshair, Tech, and Echo. They're talking to these shock troopers, and they're all using custom parts on Clone Army Customs. Oh, this is right when they get back to the Camino yeah, after yeah. 66. So they're all confused. Yeah, yeah. Clearly. What are the shock troopers doing here? Yeah. And then, so you got, these are the fire persons as well. I'm pushing a long crawl for treason Ooh. against them. On that alien planet of Mubara. Oh my god, that Pongrel figure looks so good. Yeah, he's actually an official Lego figure from like 2013. That's amazing. Yeah, I don't have one of those. Oh yeah. You can see he's throwing that guy. He's playing this first victim up there. Yeah. And I have all these pictures I take myself and they're on my Instagram. Sure. I'll give you my time. Sure, yeah, 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 absolutely. Yeah, you know, more pictures. Hey, hey, all right. Thank you. Thank you. All right.
Why don't you do me a favor and just say what you want to say? Alright? <laughs> We are done at Brickco Atlanta. We're back at the car, we're gonna eat lunch. Did you have fun? I did. All right, to lunch. All right. Guys, we are back from Brickfest. Uh, we had a great time. Everything was awesome. Uh, we we went to lunch and uh, just decided to come home. We kind of seen everything. Uh, been there for four or five hours, so uh, I didn't feel like paying <laughs> the extra money for the Papa John's that was in house. Um, I used to work there as well, so uh, I'm kind of tired of their pizza. So. Uh, but I talked to some of the uh, the organizers, and they said that they need more displayers. So uh, I decided that the uh, mock, it's a little bit messy in here right now, but the mock that I've been building, um, I decided that I'd like to spruce it up and uh, possibly display it at one of their future events. So I'll probably be trying to do that around, uh, they, they're having one in North Carolina. The one that I went to was in Atlanta. Uh, that's where I live and North Carolina is not that far away. It's only about four hours um, to Charlotte and my family owns a property up there. So uh, I'm gonna contact them and and, uh, and see if it's gonna be available. I know they may be um, making additions to the house up there or uh, something at some point, but uh, my intention as of now is to uh, have this mock displayed at Brickfest in Charlotte and uh, hopefully I'll have some of my smaller mocks as well available uh, for display and everything and um, I, I'm out of them right now. I used to have little business cards for my um, Instagram and everything like that but uh, I basically gave up on all of that uh, when I had to start working full time again. Uh, well, not just full time, it was more like 50, 60 hours a week. So I haven't really been posting. I haven't had time to like sit down and make any videos or anything like that. But uh, now that I'm, I'm pretty much finished with the mock and everything, and I want to start uh, going to these conventions more and displaying them and what have you, uh, I think that that's going to be something that I make more of an effort to uh, post more regularly and post update videos and things like that on uh on what we're doing so uh, I'm gonna be putting this mock likely to the side I won't be disassembling it for a while and then um, thinking about doing something like a for my AT-AT -AT right here uh, it sits on a gray base plate and I have from the pick a brick wall recently gotten a whole lot of white tiles and I already have a whole bunch of dark blue and light bluish gray stuff so I think that I might do a mock with the actual uh, Lego brand ATAT -AT, uh, where I may do some kind of landscape mock or something like that that's just one gray base plate wide with some of the snow troopers the snow troopers and the rebel troopers just came out in um, uh, battle packs so that seems like a, a solid choice. So why not uh, start there? That wouldn't be too piece intensive and I'm not using those colors for any other mock at this time. So uh, maybe I'll, I'll build out something like that and display it all. I'll try and keep you guys posted on that. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I hope 
that you have as much fun watching the video as I did actually going to the convention and seeing everything that was available. Um, a little bit light on the mock stuff there, but somebody's got to improve that situation uh, going forward, and so I think I'll, uh, I'll, I'll take that upon myself to try to, and uh, yeah, that's about it. Thank you guys for watching.